actually really glad you asked because we need to talk about this more. I'm not saying my insight at all supersedes a doctor's, but we do have a very real issue with weight bias in the healthcare setting. And most people see it with doctors because they interact the most with them. People will see a doctor and get referred out or they'll see one and go on their merry way. I have heard far too many stories with my own patients, clients, friends, family of blatant fat phobia in the healthcare setting, especially with their doctors. People will get told to lose weight if they have endometriosis, PCOS, muscle spasms, I've heard, anything mental health, headaches, lose weight, really intense period pain and bleeding and heavy bleeding where you pass out, lose weight. It's far too prevalent. If you don't believe me, you can Google weight bias stories in the healthcare setting. There's so many articles, way too many. There was actually a recent meta-analysis done, which is really cool, on weight bias attitudes in healthcare professionals. This study was done in 2021, so pretty recent. But as you can see, all of these professionals upheld weight bias. Dietitians included and doctors, so we're both at fault here. All these individuals are at fault. The biggest issue is a doctor or a healthcare professional will see an individual with a larger body and assume weight is the main cause of whatever issue it is. It's not just an issue with doctors, it's an entire healthcare issue and something we need to talk about more or else it's just gonna keep happening. Last thing I'll note is dietitians actually go through clinicals and we have medical nutrition therapy and a very heavy clinical intensive training. We are medical professionals, it's just not really common knowledge because no one really knows what we do.